Vernal pool crustaceans are an often overlooked aspect of the aquarium hobby. Essentially, these are organisms that grow and breed explosively in temporary pools, and then survive as inactive cysts during the dry season, much like annual killifish. I have successfully raised a number of different vernal pool species over the years, including triops, fairy shrimp, and clam shrimp. They are interesting creatures to raise due to their astoundingly quick growth rate, and though they have short lifespans, you can often save eggs to hatch out later. This time, I am going to attempt to raise a species I've never worked with before, a fairly large species known as beaver tail fairy shrimp, Thamnocephalus platyurus. I obtained this kit from ArizonaFairyShrimp.com, a seller which I have purchased from successfully at various times in the past. Many of the procedures for raising vernal pool organisms are more or less the same regardless of species. The container should be new, or if used, should be treated with bleach before use. I added one cup of bleach to this approximately four-gallon aquarium and let it stand before draining and thoroughly rinsing it. This step is important as algal and or, and or bacterial spores present in an untreated tank can easily overwhelm the hatchling organisms otherwise. Detritus, which usually looks like coarse soil, is usually included in any kit for growing vernal pool organisms. This detritus provides a food source for infusoria, which, in turn, feed the shrimp. The eggs are so small and difficult to separate that they are also generally packaged with detritus. Distilled or RO water, due to their very low mineral content, closely approximate rainwater, and thus usually lead to the best hatch rates. Light is also a stimulus that helps vernal pool organisms hatch. Sunlight, as long as it is not overdone, is helpful, though bright artificial light can work too. The eggs have a tendency to get trapped at the meniscus of the water, so filling the tank gradually over a period of several hours can help get eggs into the water column where they are more likely to hatch. Light aeration is not necessary for all species, but can be beneficial for many. With the appropriate stimuli, most vernal pool organisms will hatch within 24 hours. In an upcoming video, I plan to show the developing beaver tail shrimp.